everybody welcome back to pink crafty world today i have a project to uh share with you guys to create with you guys and is from bb craft um they send me you know guys know that i share with you guys where they send me a couple of things um to create projects and i saw that a lot of you guys are making those pokey tools uh, my friend anna's handmade creation she is making them to sell them so if you guys uh, are interested in buy from her she's on instagram and anna's handmade creations i saw them for the first time from um anna's serenity creations um so both anna's and from there everybody is creating i saw wendy i saw so many people you know creating them and you know they are very very pretty i decide that since uh bb craft sent me some materials that i wanted to try to incorporate them into you know the pokey tool and i wanted to make uh, a pokey tool uh using their products or um so we're gonna start they sent me these bowls that are gonna be using for the pokey tool and they also sent me uh these spacers and they are gold but the rhinestones on them are iridescent and they are so so pretty guys i just in love so i'm gonna try to use this for those so let's go ahead and start and uh the pokey tools actually this is from hobby lobby so here they are they came with uh plastic protectors um i removed the bottom part already and here it's how it looks so we're going to use e6000 and this is oozing really bad so let me clean this up real quick before um keeps going okay it will keep going <laughs> i know for sure but um yeah let's start real quick how it's very easy all you need is those tools and with your e6000 what you're gonna do is you're gonna put e6000 in your piece you're gonna need those uh beads i'm gonna use the bubble gum beads uh from hobby lobby or you can use the beads of you that you prefer i'm gonna use these pink ones and uh, the pink ones and, and gold ones and i don't know what colors i'm gonna be using but i grabbed these two packages here so i'm gonna be working with um this so before we put the bead we're gonna grab our bow these are the bows that they sent me from bb craft and we're going to put the E6000 on the pokey piece. And we're going to put E6000. And we're just going to put a, put, I put a little bit of E6000. And I'm going to put here the bow on top. And I'm going to put one of these beads. I'm going to use this minty color but before i'm trying to i'm going to use um, one of the spacers that they sent me uh, unfortunately for this i cannot use the spacers but i will be using the um the bow for these projects um the spacer is too small for this i so i'm sorry so i will go ahead and grab another spacer that i have here I also have these at uh bb craft these are like these daisy spacers and they are bigger so i'm gonna put them in there okay so that's how it looks and i'm going to put a little bit of the e6000 again on the wand 
this and I'm going to put the bead through there. Okay. And I'm going to put another of the spacers, the gold spacer. Okay, so it goes like that, and now we're going to put a bead, I'm going to put a gold bead in there, let's put another spacer, and you put a little bit of the glue as you go. Spacer. Okay, and I like to use E6000 because we know E6000 is a stronger adhesive and it will um, hold the piece together per permanently, you know, so that we don't have to worry about this coming off. So now I'm going to put that one. Okay. I'm going to use another daisy spacer and um, BB Craft have these daisy spacers in different sizes. Uh, they send it to me in different colors before. silver, bronze, uh, gold. So, and now we're gonna put a pink, pink bead. Let's put another, um, Okay, that's how it's looking. I'm gonna put a little bit more of the E6000 and I'm gonna put another daisy spacer right in there. Okay. And I'm gonna put Another bead. Um, let me see one second. Put a little bit more of the glue down here. There we go. ready and there we have it and now we're going to let it sit there so it will get um dry it will take uh a few hours probably to dry because we are working with the e6000 so we have to be very careful um let me see what other combination we can create. If I have more beads here, 
we can come up with different combinations of colors so um okay let's make one with this blue bow from again from uh bb craft we're gonna put a little bit of e6000 so the bow stays on place and we're gonna put here the bow i'm gonna send it through already and we're gonna get an a spacer we're gonna put more of the e6000 Go. and uh, on the one already we're going to put it there let's put whoops 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 okay Putting this cleaning the excess because I think I put too much glue on that one. Okay. And uh, let me put glue oops right there. Let's put the blue bead. How cute. Oh, I love it. Now, another spacer. And that's how you keep going, you know. Already, so that's how that one look look how cute the combination of colors are super super pretty and this is another way guys on how to use your bows and your spacers from um bb craft um you know so you can you know you know give a lot of use to their products i recommend you guys go and checking out their shop um their store is amazing um they always take well care of their product when they ship it to you and uh, you will be so appreciative of that because you know your products will come to you in very you know uh good you know shape and well taking care so yeah guys i'm uh, just gonna add some dangles to this and yeah be done so thank you so much for watching i hope to guys to see you guys soon don't forget uh the bb craft has also a youtube partner program where if you are uh, have a youtube channel you can be part of their youtube partner program uh if you have a hundred subscriber or more you can um 
sign up for the partner program and you will make uh, videos in exchange for products. So go and check them out. I will link uh, all the products down below and I will link also um, their YouTube partner program so you guys can go ahead and be part of it. So thank you so much for watching and of course I'm going to be seeing you guys in the next video. Bye-bye now.